Good morning, I'm Jan Carabeo with your morning digital news brief for Thursday, August 15th. The suspect accused of shooting six Philadelphia police officers is now in police custody. Eyewitness News was there as the suspect, 36-year-old Maurice Hill, ended a standoff with his hands up just after midnight. All six police officers who were injured were treated at hospitals and released. Police are investigating the death of a man who was beaten up and left in a North Philadelphia street where he was then run over by three different vehicles. This all happened just before midnight on the 100 block of East Lehigh Avenue right in front of Episcopal Hospital. Police say the man was in an SUV with a woman and when he got out, suspects beat him up. Investigators say the victim was lying in the eastbound lanes of Lehigh Avenue when two cars and a box truck then ran him over. Just one of those drivers stopped. If you have any information on this incident, police want to hear from you. And Sean Robert Felmy is now facing criminal homicide charges in the death of a 22-month-old boy in Falls Township, Bucks County, last December. After a lengthy investigation, police arrested Felmy in Florida in May. He now faces another court hearing next month. Now to the eyewitness weather forecast with meteorologist Katie Feelinger. Hi, Katie. And good morning to you, Jan. We've been dealing with some uh, wet weather issues for the last couple of days, and today is unfortunately no uh, different, really. We are going to see a few hit and miss showers and storms, but that's really the key here, that descriptive phrasing. It's hit or miss. It's scattered. It's isolated. And it's actually a lot more confined to the p.m. hours than what we saw yesterday, which really brought any time as fair game for us to see wet weather. Now, we have been treated to a little bit of fog out there this morning. That's mostly specific to the west and northwestern suburbs suburbs outside of Philadelphia. But there is some sunshine along the way as well. Daytime highs hit the mid 80s. Just watch for that scattered shower storm. Now the next few days do continue to look a little unsettled. They're also getting hotter too, flirting with or hitting the low 90s starting Saturday. And then for a three day stretch, you'll actually be in the 90s from Sunday through Tuesday. But along the way, again, a stray shower pop up thunderstorm may still fire up out there. Jan? All right, Katie, thanks so much. And remember, you can always get Katie's most up-to-date forecast and the latest stories right here on CBSPhilly.com. That's the latest for this morning's digital news brief. I'm Jan Carabeo. Have a great day.